Math just got important. Okay, let's take a look. Here we have these two slices of pizza. The first one, we have this being 6 inches, and this angle is 60 degrees. And for the second one, we have this right here being 7 inches, and the angle here is 45 degrees. And they have different prices. The question is, which one is a better deal? Okay, in order to figure that out, we will have to first figure out the areas for the pizzas, and then we will have to do the price divided by the area so we can figure out the unit price. Meaning, how much does it cost per unit square in terms of the area? In this case, it will be inches square. So let's talk about how to find the area of a pizza. In general, this is called a sector. It's just a portion of a circle. So if we have the whole pizza, we have a circle. And to cut pizza in the regular way, you start from the center and then just make the cuts, right? Let's just consider we have this slice here. And this angle here, I'm going to call that theta. And let's say we have the radius of the circle being r. The area of the sector is just a portion of the whole circle. Area of a sector equals, well, it depends on how big the angle is. We will have to look at the angle theta divided by the whole circle, which has 360 degrees. And sometimes you can use a different measurement called the radian, but in this case, we all have degrees, so I'll just stick with degrees. This will tell us the portion of this compared to the whole circle, and the whole circle has area, what? Pi r squared, yes. So we can use this formula here to compute the area for the slices. For the first one, the area of the slice is equal to the angle here is 60 degrees divided by 360 degrees times pi times the radius, which is 6, and then we square that. And then, of course, we can just use a calculator because um, you know you have to get some decimal numbers to get a better understanding of how big this is. I will tell you this right here is approximately. Yes, I wrote down the answer right here, so I will tell you 18.85 inches squared. For the other one though, the area of this slice of pizza, well, sector, 45 degrees divided by 360 degrees times pi times the radius, which is 7, and we square that. Put this on your calculator, we will get approximately 19.24 inches squared. So the second slice is actually bigger, but of course it's also costing more, right? So now, this right here, we will have to look at the price, which is 150. Go ahead and divide that by 18.85 inches squared. And this right here will give us approximately 0 0.0796. And the unit for this is dollar per inches squared. And if you do the same thing, which is $1.70 divided by the area, in this case, we get approximately 0 0.0884 and the uh, unit for this is dollar per inches squares so this is about like eight cents per inches squared and this right here is about almost nine cents per inches squared so which one is a better deal the first one so i'll put a little happy face here yep that's it